Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with another bonus love read which is going to be for all of you out there who really want to know when are you going to get married and who will it be? This reading is definitely for you. So I will also be adding charms in this reading. We will also be tapping into the timing of your marriage as well. So stay tuned and before I dive into the read, let me remind you. It's a general reading and if you're watching this it's a huge sign already that you are gonna find your person in the time frame that you're gonna get and um how this person is gonna be and how is the chance of you meeting them up and all the details that you need to know so yeah just be mindful it's a general reading you can book your personal reading on the email id mentioned in the description box and uh, yeah i also offer palm readings if you're interested in that check the description box for that as well so let's see who will you marry how are you going to meet this person what else can we get to know about this person and the meeting itself wow we have our first few cards here we do have the devil five of pentacles and ace of wands i really feel like you know with with five of pentacles straight away i can tell you that this person is completely single they don't have another person in their life um right now when we are doing this reading this person is in fact feeling kind of left out in terms of emotional fulfillment they really feel like maybe you know their family members everyone um that they know their close friends their their cousins they all are married of their age and they really feel like you know why it has not happened with me as of now so this person is somebody who is um feeling emotionally not happy at all and they are not with any person they are not like in a committed relationship or trying to work it out or trying to kind of come out of it so it's definitely there is no third party situation involved here i really feel like you know your person has had like a tough time to find the right partner that they that that they could feel connected to um your person could be capricorn taurus or any fire sign as well um or it can be you who has like you know capricorn taurus or fire sign at a very dominant uh, position in your chart but i really feel like you know your person is going to be somebody who who is looking for a very solid kind of connection it seems like you know they can be an earth sign for sure um but um they, they might have fire in their chart as well but i really see this person to be somebody who is looking for a loving relationship which is very committed and mutual um they might have been through in relationships that didn't work out the way they wanted but as far as I can see, this person has been single for quite some years, maybe. Um, and I really feel like at least for one year, they have been single. Um, and this person is not like, you know, somebody who's looking for love. Uh, this person is somebody who wants to be in a relationship, but they don't want to kind of chase it out. Um, I really feel like you know, they're waiting for the divine timing to work and play in their love life. But this person is somebody who has been through a lot on personal level as well. They might have seen through... Um, you know the tough times in their life and they now are in a very stable position in their life um, I feel like you know this person is somebody who um, who have achieved all they wanted to achieve with their hard work this person is not somebody who was solved with something good in their life they always achieved things with their hard effort that they have put in and I really feel like you know, this person is somebody who is um, who has kind of managed to get through the tough time on their own on their abilities this person is somebody who's very passionate now i really feel like they have been through the tough time but now they know how to work things out so they are somebody who has a lot of experience in life so they can be somebody who is mature than you um or at least mature in experience uh but this person is somebody who loves to create what they want to create for themselves so they they are very focused that way they are somebody who's very um they they know how to work things out now and um right now i really feel like you know, this person is somebody who's very uh, you know inspirational somebody who's very energetic this person is somebody who loves to um you know um maybe they are into adventurous things as well for some of you but i really see it to be somebody um very um in tune with their emotions now i feel like you know, that's how it is and they they are waiting for the right timing uh to work in in their life i really feel like you know this person is somebody who's very well known in their groups uh in their community as well uh in the group of uh you know um, in terms of um what they do for a living they're very kind of like well-known personality there uh this person can be somebody who is very good with communication as well um i really see this person to be very patient responsible um this person is uh, somebody that you can depend upon for sure so they are you know 
um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, one one um, attribute of this person's personality could be um, that they are very uh, possessive. They are very, um, you know, they, 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 you know, if you are theirs, you are theirs. They are going to have that kind of attitude. Uh, right now, they are single. They don't care about anything. But when you are with them, they would make sure that they take care of you in, in a mad crazy way. So this is going to be somebody how... Uh, very uh, is very protective of you. I really feel like you know um, Right now I feel for majority of you this person can also be a Cantorian for some of you uh, But I really feel like you know this person is somebody who um, Who Who is not a fun kind of a person in terms of they don't go to parties and stuff They are like, you know, they would rather give their time and energy to building something for themselves in career or in on personal level um, this person loves to spend time in the nature is what I can see here and they are somebody who has achieved a lot of success as well So that's how they are. Let's see some more cards about this person and uh, maybe their personality traits um, Whatever we can get to know about them What else can we get to know about this person? Their feature nature anything that we can get to know about this person I really feel for some of you, you could be completely different uh, people, like as an individual. Uh, this person could have subtle features, quite modest, mysterious, wise, counselor, innovative. They could also be bold, attractive, with colored hair, sunny nature, uplifting and caring. I really feel like you, know, you two could be quite um, opposite. Like maybe for some of you, you are like the sunny nature kind of a person. They are kind of a quite kind of a person uh, with a lot of mystery around them. Um, but yeah, let's see some more cards here. What else can we get to know about this person? What else can we get to know about this person? And how can you meet this person? How will you meet this person? Anything, any information that we can get to know about the person that you're going to marry? This person is uh, into love rituals or rituals. It's uh, you know it's it's something that they they love uh, you know um, doing. They might be some somebody who's very religious. This person can be somebody who's very spiritual. Uh, this person can be somebody who's who believes in clearing energy and all those things. Like you know they work with energies. I believe for some of you, but this person is definitely into rituals and they are very uh, protected. In terms of their energies and that's why i feel like you know, this is an art that they have learned over the period of time this is something that they have uh, achieved with experience and i really feel like you know, they, they believe in themselves that uh, you know a lot as well that they can have or do or achieve anything that they set themselves to achieve um this person can be somebody into music uh, they love playing music is what i can see but i really feel like you know, their music is not like the you know the the gen z kind of music is what i can see here it's more of a drum that i see and then there is this one thing i don't know what you call it in english but there is a definitely is a name of the instrument that we see here i don't know what what you say it in uh, in English but uh, I really feel like it's more of a spiritual um, you know thing um, but I really see this person having a different taste in music as well uh, this person can be somebody who again we have the colored hair maybe you are colored hair and this person has black hair or blonde maybe uh, or maybe they have purple hair uh, for some of you but I really feel like you know, this person is into taking care of themselves a lot this person can also be somebody who's very good looking for some of you um, this person can be age 37. Uh, number five or seven could be significant as well. Uh, let's see, where can you meet? You might meet this person at a um, musical event as well for some of you. You might meet this person at a spa uh, where they are taking good care of their self, their beauty. Um, but um, yeah, I really feel like you know, this person is a very family kind of a family oriented person. I really feel like you know, they, they love their parents, especially they, they love to chat with their parents. Um, you might be this person uh, uh, in the rain, like, you know, maybe it's raining and you bump into each other and something like that. This person loves rains as well. I really feel like you know, this person is somebody who, um, who is, I really see them as, I can pick up their energy. They, they love nature. They love spending time with the basic things, like, you know, the nature, the rain, family. They are very um, homely kind of a person is what I can see. Uh, that way they really don't like to go to places which are crowded or something like that um let's see um some 
chance. Let's see what the chance has to add. You might meet this person when they are out with their family or especially with their parents. Um, maybe that's how you're going to meet this person. But let's see what the chance has to add. I like the way you look at me. I really feel like you know, this person is going to find you way attractive. Your eyes are going to be like something which is going to do the magic for them. They're going to love the way you look at them. Um, let's meet up soon. I really feel like, you know, this person is going to be like somebody that you're going to see, uh, you know, uh, not online, but direct. Like, you know, it's going to be a meeting that's going to take place, which is going to be very special to them. Uh, we do have five pentacles again and six of wands. Again, I really feel like, you know, um, this person can be somebody who is very successful. Um, they, they might have dealt with some sort of, a, um, you know, um, some sort of, uh, stress regarding finances in the in the beginning maybe let me take one card from the middle of the deck just to know about what the five of pentacles is, is all about wow i really feel like you know for some of you they might be feeling lost because maybe they have lost somebody dear to them that's why they are kind of like stressed out for some of you but they are definitely very successful when we talk about the alphabets we have o k x s v g G, E, S, U, J, B, L, J, P, O, F, J, I, E, F, and Z. So these could be your name, initial name, initial of the person that you're dealing with. They could be also the alphabets of the city or country where they live in as well. This person can be a um, fire sign like I told earlier, maybe a Leo. Um, I really feel like this person has a sense of direction. Where they're going, they are very sure of that. Um, this person is somebody who, again, uh, could be very spiritual. Um, you might start seeing signs and messages coming from the divine before the two of you meet. Um, this person has transformed to what they used to be and to what they are and they are going to bring the transformation in your life as well um this person is going to help you move past the past um you are definitely going to have a beautiful home with this person um i feel like you know for some of you you might be always moving traveling with this person so they might be somebody who is into work in a way where they have to travel a lot for their work um but this person is going to be somebody who is who has a very um he, who is an old soul is what i can see here uh this person is uh, going to be like entering in your life and change everything in 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 the good way um they are going to bring happy changes in your life um this person is going to be like um i really feel like you know they are going to be on the by their side like you know the, by themselves i just see this person living alone they are not going to be living with the family they have a strong bond with the family but maybe they are right now you know not living with the family maybe that's why they're feeling left out or you know left alone for some of you and i feel like you know, that's going to be the reason why they're going to stay very connected to you as well because they you they would take you as their home and that's how you are going to mean so much to this person they're going to love you for so sure and they are definitely going to bring you a lot of gifts is what i can see here this person is going to make sure that this connection stays filled with lots of love you might be traveling a lot with this person again they for some of you this person can be a water sign like i told earlier maybe cancer is in specific you might meet this person in london or maybe this person travels a lot to london but yeah this person has a um you know has big dreams and they are very hopeful somebody who's very positive um they they are very truthful as well i really feel like you know they are definitely somebody that you can trust upon as well so yeah that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, read if it was of help do like share and subscribe and till i do the next reading for you guys take care and yeah don't forget to claim this energy coming for you in your love life um oh we have a unicorn too i really see this person to be very lucky for you i really feel like you know, they are going to bring a lot of luck and happiness in your life for sure um and your life is going to be like upgrading to higher level of uh, you know um i really see you getting um upgraded to uh, different standards of living is what i can see here um maybe it's because of the travel that you're going to be having with this person a lot of the time but yeah that's pretty much it and uh, yeah if you're willing to purchase any of the services uh to manifest your life partner you can also check the description box for that till i do the next read take care bye